Hey everyone, this is Disc Junkie, and today I'm reviewing Seven. And this is the old, quite classic these days, uh, New Line Platinum Series release. Uh, and it is the American version, obviously. Uh, now, I recently showed you the Japanese edition, which has very similar style Diggy Pack, uh, but I wanted to show this, even though it is an old release and you've probably seen it. Um, I think it's, you know, I just want to add it to the database, so... Anyway, uh, it has a matte slipcase and a slightly glossy print for the uh, the logo. Uh, and as you can see, it's sort of... It's like a sort of multi-layer logo style. You got like a half semi-glossy print for, you know, all the letters. And it's done in both black and white, so, you know, from this angle you can't really see it. But in the right light, you can notice that there's, you know, there's multiple printed, printed layers there. So, anyway, I really like the the detail of the the graphic logo. Um, sadly, it's not embossed or anything. It's just flat printed. But still, a uh, really nice design of you know one of the greatest original uh, movie logos of all time. Uh, if you ask me, I just you know the Seven logo is just so classic. So it's nice to see that they. Uh, used it. Uh, anyway, here we got the spine and the back cover. And now the US, this is the US 2 disc special edition. Uh, and it is, I think that one of the reasons why this particular edition has held up so well over time in terms of special features uh, is that uh, it's such a well, uh, well made set to begin with, you know. David Fincher really made sure that uh, the special features were were good, and he had a big part in uh, in the whole making of the this the set, so to speak. And uh, I don't know what to say. It's uh, you know I, I really like the look of the Diggy Pack, sort of replicating one of the uh, the John Doe notebooks from the film, so to speak. So you know a simple, clever idea, very nicely done. And also, you know, the inside graphics of this are just stunning. I just, just love the look of them. And uh, like I said, it's it's incredibly similar to the the Japanese edition, um, which I've showed in a separate video. Uh, this one obviously came uh, first, so the Japanese version would be a uh, a copy or or you know uh, a packaging inspired by this rather than the other way around, but. Uh, I'm actually I'm gonna do a comparison video just side by side to show you uh, exactly what the graphic differences are between these this one and the Japanese version. Uh, but you can check that for a later video. But anyway, here are the discs, which also really nicely designed, I think. So yeah, uh, that's it for me today. I uh, hope you all enjoyed this, and as usual, I'll see you all next time.